protocol. I told you about a protocol called Montreal Protocol. See, under Montreal Protocol, there was one amendment to Montreal Protocol. One and a half year, two years back, all countries in the world, most of them went to a place in a small place, small country in the world called Rwanda. Rwanda is in Africa. Everyone surprised. Why they went to Rwanda? Where they went to capital? Kigali. Kigali. K I G A L I. Kigali. So, they have signed an agreement called Kigali Agreement. Kigali Agreement is related to HFCs. Kigali Agreement is related to HFCs. Hydrofluorocarbons. What are HFCs? See, from air conditioner industries, refrigerators, we release HFCs. Kigali Agreement is related to decreasing of HFCs, which is a part of Mo Montreal Protocol. In the 28th meeting of the parties in the Montreal Protocol, 197 nations have signed. 197 nations have signed a historic agreement to amend the Montreal Protocol in Kigali in 2016. A historic agreement to amend the Montreal Protocol in Kigali in 2016. As per the agreement, as per the agreement, these countries agreed to reduce, agreed to decrease, expected decrease was 80 to 85 percent in all industries. The release of HFCs, the release of HFCs, HFCs and the deadline is 2045, 2045. And if this promise in Kigali is fulfilled, at least 0.5 degrees Celsius in the rise of temperatures can be minimized. At least 0.5 degrees we can minimize. Kigali agreement is an amendment to Montreal protocol. Remember, Kigali agreement is an amendment to Montreal protocol. So, HFCs we have to immediately address. Mostly automobile industries, air conditioning industries, air conditioners, refrigerators will have high number of, large number of HFCs. So, we have next an important convention. In 1972, the first ever declaration about environment is Stockholm Declaration. 1972, the first ever declaration is Stockholm Declaration in the year 1972. In that Stockholm Declaration 1972, June 5th was considered as International Environmental Day. June 5th was considered as International Environmental Day. June 5th and 26 principles were signed. 26 principles were signed in the Stockholm Declaration. How many principles? 26 were signed. And after that, in 1982, we have a summit called Nairobi Summit. A summit called Nairobi Summit. In 1992, we have a summit called Earth Summit or Rio Summit. 1972, Stockholm Summit. 1982, Nairobi Summit. 1992, Rio Summit. Here comes 1997, one more important protocol. Kyoto Protocol 1997 One more protocol called Kyoto Protocol Kyoto Protocol is related to Kyoto Protocol is related to Reduction of GHGs Greenhouse Gas Emissions Reduction of GHGs What are greenhouse gases? Carbon dioxide is a greenhouse gas Ozone is a greenhouse gas, 
HFC is a greenhouse gas. All these things comes under greenhouse gases. Kyoto Protocol is related to greenhouse gas emissions. You know what is the promise in the Kyoto Protocol? Kyoto Protocol says between 2007 to 2012, between 2007 to 2012, the greenhouse gas emissions, the greenhouse gas emissions should be taken to 1990 levels. Based on 1990 levels, you should reduce 5 percent. So, the greenhouse gas emissions according to Kyoto Protocol should be taken to 1990 levels. Baseline 1990 levels, you have to reduce 5 percent. That is Kyoto Protocol. <coughs> Deals with greenhouse gas emissions. Kyoto Protocol is related to greenhouse gas emissions. And you have other protocols. Geneva Convention. Important convention. Geneva Convention on Technology and Financial Help. Geneva Convention on Technology and Financial Help to Developing Countries. Technology and Financial Help to Developing Countries. Next. World Summit on Sustainable Development. World Summit on Sustainable Development. Johannesburg, 2002. World Summit on Sustainable Development, Johannesburg 2002. Next. Right now we are working on Paris Climate Deal. At present we are working on Paris Climate Deal. Okay. So this is how you have to study international conventions and protocols with respect to environmental protection, international conventions and protocols. Now I